Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I am gonna show you how to create half tones in Photoshop for screen printing. A lot of people have this question of whether you need a RIP software to get high quality half tones. The answer is no. You don't need a RIP software to create nice and crisp half tone dots that produce super quality prints. In Photoshop, we can get half tones like we get using a RIP software. You just need to know the proper steps to create half tones in Photoshop, which is what I'm gonna show you in this video. So let's dive right into the video. Alright, now let's say we want to create half tones of this image to print on a t-shirt. Make sure you have a high quality image to start with. First, let's check the resolution of this image. I'll go to image, image size. The resolution of this image is 72 dpi. If you want half tones like the ones you get in a RIP software, first you need to change the resolution of the image to a high value. Otherwise the half tone dots won't be good enough to produce a high quality print. So let's change the resolution to 1200 dpi. 1200 dpi is a sweet spot to get high quality half tones like the half tones produced from a rip software remember when you convert an image from 72 dpi to a high resolution like 1200 dpi photoshop will utilize all your cpu resources if your pc does not have a high configuration you can set the resolution to a lower number like 450 dpi and still get nice half tones Below 450 dpi, your half tones won't look good when printed. You can set the resolution to 450, 600, 800 or 1200 according to your PC specs and the size of the image that you are working with. I'll choose 1200 dpi and click OK. I'll zoom out. Now, to create half tones from this image, first we need to convert this image into a grayscale. To do that, go to image, mode, and then choose grayscale. Discard the color information. Now the image has become a grayscale image. Now go to image, mode, and then choose bitmap. Make sure the input and output resolutions are the same. In the method, choose halftone screen and then click OK. In this halftone screen window, choose the frequency according to the mesh count you use. I am choosing 45. Angle I will choose 22.5 degrees. In the shape I will choose round. And then click OK. Now let's zoom in and see. We have got nice, crisp and round, high quality half tone dots like the ones we get from a RIP software. Remember that the high resolution is the key here. Now I will repeat the same steps on the same image but with a low resolution like 300 dpi. Let's compare the half tone dots from both the images side by side. See the half tone dots created from 1200 dpi image is so crisp and of high quality like what we get from a RIP software. So always use the high resolution when you create half tone dots to get a high quality print. When you do color separation or any other design work, you can work with 300 dpi. But when you create half tones, you need to convert the image to a higher resolution. So that's it. In this video, I showed you how to create high quality half tones in Photoshop for screen printing without using a RIP software. Hope you find this video helpful. I'll see you in another video. Take care.